Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I wanted to show you this look here, but I kind of wanted to do kind of a dewy, glowy look as summer is almost here, although in England it's ice cold. And I know how hard it is for those of us with oily skin to achieve a look that is glowy and highlighted versus looking greasy. The struggle is really real when you have really oily skin or even combination skin and you want your highlight to be brighter than so many people's futures and not to be an oil slick. So I wanted to kind of show you how I do that. And I think it's really important to focus on what you do to your face beforehand to give you the right kind of base um, and then focus on what you put on top of your foundation and stuff like that. And I still use powders and everything, even if I am doing kind of a dewy look, just because I know that in like three hours, I'm going to look like a disco ball if I don't set my makeup and stuff. But it's really easy to do. Um, I'll list everything in the description bar below and I always say it's not necessarily about the products that you use but how you use them and if you don't use the ones that I use there's usually an alternative on the market that you can do and I will do a drugstore makeup tutorial at some point in time I know I keep saying it I'm sorry I will definitely get that sorted out for you guys and any videos you guys want to see next please do let me know because I was feeling a bit dry um my 10 hacks for women video has done absolutely amazingly like it's on over 2 million I'm like guys you really like those kind of videos so I'm going to see what else I can do and get things that are really really useful for people versus just you know trendy anyway guys I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I will catch you later bye so I start off with priming my face because I hate looking oily I'm loving this Invisibler from Morad which is also an SPF and I find that it makes my skin super smooth and super matte after that I move on to my brows and so many of you guys have noticed that my brows have changed quite a bit. I basically draw a line on the top and the bottom and I fill them in and I've stopped getting them plucked or waxed or anything like that and I just let them grow naturally and I use a spoolie just to soften the edges and the wonder product when it comes to brow is a concealer. I'm using my Urban Decay Concealer, um, which I use basically for most of my face, but it's the best way to kind of neaten up brows. After that, I'm using this gorgeous foundation from Becca, and it's a luminous foundation. And this is when I say it's all about, you know, getting the glow. I love this because it's kind of got an iridescentness to it. And I think it's perfect for the summer. But you can use any foundation that works for your skin. But I'm just loving this one right now. So I mentioned this um, Urban Decay Concealer in a video a while back. This concealer is ridiculously amazing, especially for us oily girls. I find that it dries quite quickly and it dries very matte and it lasts all day like if you're gonna get oily it's not gonna get oily in those areas and I love it I'm going in quickly with this quad from Illamasqua and I've loved using oranges on my eyes right now which is kind of random and I just kind of use that all over my lid and I'm using this sleek palette here it's got a really nice kind of beigey white that I use on my lid and I use this as a trick to make my lids look a little bit bigger because my lids are super small I go ahead with a darker brown just to add a bit of dimension and I'll go ahead with a liquid liner as well this one here is the matte Maybelline ink one excellent And I'm going ahead and use my false lash sculpt mascara from L'Oreal as well on my baby lashes. <laughs> but I usually go ahead and wear falsies. I like to use foundation to conceal. This is the double wear in mahogany. And I just do it across my nose. And I usually just use my fingers to blend. It's really easy. And then I just do the sides of my cheeks as well. I don't know why, I just like the way foundation looks versus powders. Now this stuff is the miracle product for us oily girls. The setting powder from Sasha is great and I use it under my eyes, I use it on my chin, my cheeks, just to kind of contour a little bit and I just rub it in. And I think I've actually just put some tart powder on as well. Now for my glow, I'm using this Illamasqua highlighter which is literally 
everything and I try to do it quite carefully because you can go a bit overboard with your highlight but this is just gorgeous and I just do it on the top of my cheekbones and I also do it down the bridge of my nose as well and I add a touch to the top of my lip. Now this is another really nice product from Becca. I think it's kind of like a whole glowing range basically. This is a gorgeous blush that you can clearly see I'm loving. For my lips, I go ahead and line with Bobbi Brown's Chocolate. It's a really nice liner, but because the rest of my face is feeling kind of dewy and glowy, I'm gonna go in with a matte lipstick from YSL, which I just love this soft color. And that is me basically done. So guys, that is my finished look. Hopefully you can see that I look kind of highlighted and dewy and hopefully it's easy to do for anyone who might be trying to recreate a look that I do. And I always say, I'm not a makeup pro. I'm definitely an enthusiast who likes transforming my face once in a while. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that video and I will catch you later. Bye.